Hey everybody, this is Beach Ray 20. Just uh, showing you guys that I hooked up the Soundstream 7 band parametric equalizer MPQ 7XO. Lights up blue, or very nice blue. Very clean. I did the unboxing and, um, yesterday in the previous video. I'm just showing you guys um, how it all works out. So, the ground wire, remote, and 12 volt. Straightforward. I have my, um, my RCAs that goes to my bass amplifier. These RCAs that says CD go into the back of the unit here. The only RCAs that are in the back of the unit. These are front rear and sub output I use the front because it's the EQ's job to do the rest so I just from the front of the back of the hay unit to the CD input then I have uh, the front and the rear of course go to my amplifier here which is on my mids and highs. And this bass amplifier here. Just sitting in the corner. Everything's a little junky. Nothing's ever set in stone in my, my truck. But it's fused here. This is the line that goes to the to the positive uh the equalizer. And this, of course, goes to the negative. The negative is wired to the black, which is the ground from the, um, the factory harness. And then the power is wired to, of course, the yellow of the factory harness for constant. Then the remote wire here is wired to the back of the radios it's a blue if I can get to it this blue and white wire here that I'm holding it's a blue and white wire that's um, like an antenna wire it helps power this on cars off EQs off just as well as the radio Power is on. Everything's powered back up. When the radio is on, so is the equalizer. So I'm gonna play a little song for you guys. I don't own the rights to this music. Just to give you guys a little idea. Now on this unit, I have my front. Sorry about that. I have my front hooked up to my tweeters. And I have my rear hooked up to my door speakers. So this, on this unit, this little silk clear back piece, you can turn that left for front or right. Right for rear. And I have my door speakers on the rear and my tweeters only on my front. And I'm going to let you guys hear that. So this is my tweeters only, tweeters only, all the way to the left, front. I could just play with the frequencies, change the amplify the sound, or help tune the sound of my tweeters. Alright. 
Then I can put it to the rear. That's my door speakers. Turn that up. Now I can just equalize my rear speakers by itself. Find out not all of them are front. Just the way I have it. I have front for my tweeters, rear for my door speakers, so like this, all the way to the right, which is rear, it's only my door speakers, all the way to the left, it's all my tweeters, but then put it in the middle, it's both. Yeah, so. That's the way I got it. Um, and of course, uh, like I said, I have my bass hooked up, and this is a sub volume. So I'm gonna let you guys hear how that sounds when the sub comes in. I got my vest on, motherfuckers already know what it really is. You work out, like You work out. Yeah, so, I mean, it's, it's pretty straightforward. Front and rear, mids and highs. Um, you can put it any way you want. You can have your front doors on your front and your rear doors, of course, on your rear. Um, me, I just have my tweeters on my front and I have my rear on my door speakers. Only for the simple fact that I want to be able to, not everybody can stand the tweeter sound. So I want to be able to tune it out when needed. So that's why I did did it this way. But um, it's a nice unit. I really like it. It's really clean. I'm going to go ahead and tie everything in and um, get rid of all this mess. Hope you guys like what you've seen. Like I said, it's pretty straightforward. Very straightforward. Fuse to the yellow. The factory. Which is a 12 volt input to the EQ. The remote, which is the gray, goes into that blue and white wire here. Blue and white. Then, of course, your ground, which is G and D, goes straight to the ground on a unit. Or, you can ground it to a little piece of metal. So we're like over here, it's all rusty back there, but clean that up a little bit, shave it down, probably scrape it down to um, a clean, solid, bare metal, and you can ground there just as good. And um, you'll be able to get the power going that you need to EQ. It's off now. Turn on the radio. There you go. Stay tuned for more vids. Hope you guys like what you've seen here. Stay tuned for more.